In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a contact person and a user in Onyx work. First, we go to settings. Here we can see the contacts and users already created for my company. And by adding a new one, we click new on the top left. Here we can fill out some information. The purple fields are mandatory. So we simply add the name and the email address and we click save. We have now created a contact person. If we want to invite Ola as a user, we go to user privileges. Here we add the license. We can also check these boxes to determine the access that Ola is gonna have in Onyx work. We click save again and we go back to main. We can now invite the user by clicking here. And now an email will be sent to Ola where he can create a password and log on to Onyx work. If Ola also wants access to Onyx inspection, we can do that now. We then recommend to add a, add a signature to the user, which you can do here at the bottom by clicking these three dots and uploading your signature. Then go to control categories, check the boxes that Ola is certified for, click save, and then go back to user privileges and select Onyx inspection. We now click save and Onyx inspection is also included in his license. Lastly, just going to explain what these icons mean. This blue plane here means that we have sent an invitation to Ola, but it has not been accepted yet. If there isn't any icon, this is simply a contact person. And if it is a full user in Onyx work, they will have this icon in their name. And that is how you create a contact person and a user in Onyx work.